Hello neighbors, Ariana here from The Therapist Next Door. Welcome back. This video is for people that don't wanna have kids. So I wanna just give you guys some tips and tools that you can use as you navigate that choice in your life. So first of all, I wanna really normalize and congratulate you for being able to make that decision. It's not easy, even though we are in a modern day, there still are pressures from society and family to have kids and have a traditional lifestyle. But I do think it's something that requires a lot of consideration and you have to really be honest with yourself. If you are somebody that's willing to make the sacrifices that being a parent requires. And so if you've made the decision that that's not for you, for whatever reason that may be, I really want you to honor that and take pride in the fact that you took the time to think about something so monumental and you're not just doing something because you think that you should. So it is okay to not want to have children. Now, I think the main difficulty for people is how to talk about that with their friends and family or other people. A lot of times you'd be surprised people have really strange reactions when you tell them that you don't wanna have kids. They may even say things like, oh, you'll change your mind when you find the right one and things like that. So, I just want to give you some tips and tools for how to handle that. So when it comes to your family, if you really are sure that you don't want to have kids, I think it's good to be as assertive as you can. Again, you don't want to be defensive. You don't want to avoid this conversation, but you want to let them know, look, I know this might be disappointing to you, but it's something that I really took time to consider. And this is a decision I've come to. This is a decision that I feel is right for me. And you may not be here yet, but I would love at some point if you could come to accept that and support me with that decision. So that is an example of a conversation that you may have with a family member. So when people get defensive or when they avoid, what tends to happen is that family members will continue to bring it up because you're not really putting that respectful boundary up. And so they think that they might be able to change your mind or pressure you into something that's really their agenda and not yours. So be assertive and i think that will really go a long way you also want to be considerate you're not apologizing for your decision but you are acknowledging that it might be disappointing for some of your family members so that's how i would suggest you deal with family now the next category would be when it comes to dating or relationships i think that whether people want to have children don't want to have children or are undecided is kind of an important factor in dating and really can become a deal breaker in terms of compatibility. If you are 100% certain that you don't want to have kids or you're really leaning towards that way, you want to be upfront about this. You want to be upfront about this in your dating profile. And if you're not using dating apps, you probably want to be upfront about it within, I would say, the first few dates. I don't think you need to discuss it on the first date because at that point you're just assessing for chemistry. But after that, you know, when you do start talking about what you're looking for, I think that that should be something that is included because, again, this is a deal breaker. And if you allow yourself to fall in love with someone or they fall in love with you, and then, you know, shortly down the road, you realize that you can't be together, it's just going to be a lot of heartache that you could have avoided from the beginning. I, again, recommend being very upfront with that when it comes to dating. So that's all I have for that. Again, I commend you for taking the time to think about this decision and maybe make a decision that might not be popular with your family or even with your culture or society, but is such a huge decision that requires a lot of thought and consideration. So good job for doing that. And there's a lot of people out there, believe it or not, that also don't want to have kids. And so you know, you'll be able to find that community as well. So if there's anything more that you're wondering about or you have questions about, please leave them below in the comments. Please like, comment, and subscribe so I can keep bringing you this content. And as always, authentically yours, Ariana.